Welcome. E aí, galera, beleza? Bem-vindo à nossa comunidade. Welcome to our community. Hey, what's going on, guys? It is OGC here. Today, we have our last Clash Fade for the regular season. So far, we are not doing super good. We have only won one fight we lost to uh, for a variety of reasons. So we need to win today so we get a little bit of extra Lunari and everything because the lucky wheel is still out there. So, fair warning, guys. Um, while, we, while we take a look at all of this... Um, <clears throat> We will be talking quite a bit about uh, Toby, Chip, and uh, Taint. Uh, I will definitely be fanboying uh, quite a bit uh, today and talking about them just because, you know, uh, it matters. Ooh, dwarf. Um, that being said, uh, I hope you guys liked yesterday's live stream where we, uh, where we pretty much had like a bunch of awesome people on, on the channel, uh, such as Toby, Taint, and... Uh, uh, Chip, <clears throat> so I'm just going to fanboy for a little bit, uh, so don't mind me if I go off on tangents about it, but I thought it was wicked cool. You get a collection of, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, this is brutal. Hey, I, I need some venti ice mocha. All right, now that I feel better, um, I thought it was really cool to get like a collection of just like awesome dudes and... Uh, Hopefully we'll have some awesome ladies soon, but have some awesome dudes all, all together who kind of, um, oh, actually maybe I need Gazool in case they put out the, uh, snipers, who have, like, a, a variety of play. I, I know Toby and Taint were talking about having, like, similar styles at, to, to one, one another, but they're all at, like, uh, different points, but to, to me, they're all, like, way up here, and I consider myself, like, way down here, so... It's cool to learn from people that, that help us out. Like, uh, Tane helped us out so much with uh, the, the shards and literally changing our views on that. Chip did the same thing with the dragons a, a little while ago. I, I think the dragon videos got like 10,000 views. It, it's wild. It's wild. So it's awesome uh, to get all those people together. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. For right now, though, we need to try and win going up against this dwarf player. Um, hopefully we can do it. Looks like they just have a, 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 a ton of mechs and stuff, which is fine. This is going to be so much karma uh, if I can if I can actually win it. Wow. Yeah, th this is this is nuts. Uh, anyways, uh, so hopefully we can uh, we, we can win this fight. Um, that would be a good way to start off everything. They are definitely coming in really hard with the uh, try, trying to hit us with the. Um, Jax, they just did a firestorm. I don't know what they took out. We definitely need our Bazrix to stay up for this fight. If our Bazrix goes down, that's just going to be a lot of uh, potential problems for us. We also need to be able to take down their, their Ophidius. That's that's my other big thing that I, I'm really concerned about. Uh, if we can take down their Ophidius, our Ophidius stays up. That's huge. Uh, let's see. All right, I think we we did everything there. Their dragon's almost down, which which is uh, honestly really nice. We we have to drop their their dragon. Um, and let's see here. Can we also get that there? Awesome, awesome. All right, so far so so good. Uh, pr pretty happy with everything so far. All right, so their old face is slowly starting to drop. All right, so that's all good stuff. Uh, so far, guys, this is going well. We're going to get so much karma from this fight. So I think this guy was um, 3,800k core. Uh, so we're finally starting to, to not just do horrible going going up against uh, players that are close to our core. When I got this uh, account, it was um, we were definitely behind in, in some ways. Uh, so... Amazing temple on this account. It was behind in chakra. Like I, I had to buy a lot of chakra just to get uh, chakra fifteen for two troop types, and then uh, and then we're we're we were behind with uh, dragonic because I had to get a little bit of, of chakra, uh, and I don't really spend um, <laughs> can, comparatively to everybody else. It's just not there. So this account is finally starting to get um, back up to where it should be. Uh, and honestly, it has so much potential to keep going, too. Let's try out the karma real quick. Bam! Number one. We got to find that dwarf person and, and fight them over and over. Uh, because 
it is a lot of chakras. So far, it looks like uh, it, this is really close. Uh, we control two, they control one. We're at 19, they're at 18 as far as people. Um, now they just neutralized the top. Uh, and I think we're, we're at order. Um, whoops. Yeah, so th this is going to this is going to be a close fight, guys. If we win this, we're we're going to really oh geez, they got a big person there. Uh, we're going to really have to fight for this. All right, let's go take on this human player. We are definitely missing out on a bunch of stuff. However, however, we still have our dragon. We got trees. That's all you need: dragon and trees, and you're good for self. So, uh, one of the really cool things uh, is. I, I think I met, um, again, as I said, this whole Clash of Fate, I'm just going to be fanboying out uh, on yesterday's video. I met Taint probably at least a year ago or so on uh, on Facebook. Um, I think before I, I even like really did did videos and stuff, wow, we got that whole side still up. That, that's huge. Um, like, like Honestly, before I, I was really doing a ton with, with the, the videos, and uh, it it's just, um, I, I guess we won't do that. I think it's it's mad, mad cool because um, you just have people that that enjoy uh, the, the game, uh, talking with each other or hanging out, and we we send a bunch of messages. So to be able to start there and just uh, kind of progress in in uh, talking with each other and also playing, like I'd, I'd love to be in the same Drake as him. But he's been able to accomplish so many cool things in this game. I would never want to have to fight him in a war server because. He's the type of player that has the uh, the the past where he can get real nitty and gritty, and doesn't matter if he's stuck in the capital, he's going to keep you in the capital as well. And those types of players, in my opinion, are just terrifying because they 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 have nothing to lose. They and they don't care what they do lose. All right, cool. So this guy is actually going to try. Um, we won in three sets, which is uh, massive. I will take that literally any day. Uh, looks like we're going to have some trouble with his arches down here, uh, but our Denji is getting somewhat deep, which is nice. Uh, so we're going to focus on the middle pack of archers, because I think our Denji and everything is going to be able to blow up this uh, this bottom pack. They have a Belrog down here, which, which is just going to cause a little bit of issues for us. I don't think it's going to be anything super massive, but it's still going to be annoying nonetheless. Yes, humans, I really do enjoy doing a black hole, just because a black hole will help out. We lost Lunella, which is uh, which is uh, slightly weird, um, but that's okay. We still got Jax, we got Denji, uh, we still have Ophidius up. Uh, I mean, we're 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 looking good. Uh, we we do have a giant core advantage going up against this player, so I mean, nothing too wild, no, nothing that we we shouldn't be expecting, anyways. Uh, looks like all of their heroes are down now. We're we're just going to take out all of their their troops. Uh, good stuff. If these guys keep fighting me like this. And we don't get any like ridiculous matches. We might actually have a decent shot at placing well in karma. I know in in the past, uh, karma is not something that I focus on. Um, it's it's all about being being a team player. But you know what? If we can get the points, might, might as well. I have a feeling we're going to get jumped. All right, we're not going to get jumped. How are we doing o overall? Uh, Omen. Okay, so Omen's really big. Uh, I think Omen's still down here. I believe, yeah, so they're they're uh, a big player. Um, we're still going to stay down here and hang out in this bottom area. Uh, Omen will probably take us out. Uh, otherwise, we can jump on top of this person because we can definitely win that. Uh, when it comes to Chip, just, just for a little bit of background for, for Chip, I met Chip through uh, the, the Discord. Before it was even the OGC community Discord, I just happened to, to join that Discord. And I forget how I ended up on that Discord. And then uh, upon talk, talking with uh, with people there, um, yeah, it, it just, one thing led to another. So I, I started uh, talking on there. Um, and I, I think it was Chan. Chan was posting pictures of me, which is so weird. At the time, like, I, I still didn't have, like, the green screen or anything. And, and she's pulling up pictures. And um, it, it was really fun. Like, it it felt inclusive. It, it felt like they wanted you there, which is why I, I fell in love with the whole idea. And uh, Chip invited me down to join them for the championship, um, the Clash of Fate, which was the first one ever. So... I ran it by my house. My house said yes. Uh, I got separated from, from my house for, for a long time, um, months and months and months. Um, but anyways, 
that's how I ended up in Blood Moon. I didn't think I'd stay there forever. Um, and now I can't imagine playing the game anywhere else. Uh, it's, it's the only place I'd want to play the game. Uh, like, honestly, I didn't, and I'm biased. I get it. I, I have a very biased opinion. And it's amazing at um, the philosophy that, that they... Oh, geez, we, we lost some stuff. Uh, it's amazing at, at the philosophy that, that they have. Um, and by they, I mean like uh, Chip and everyone. Um, it's really, really cool because it's not just about... Yeah, we're going to get Bazrix up there. Oh, yeah. Uh, it's it's not just about like... Uh, I don't I don't know how to describe it how strong you are and things like that. Like it really is um, that, that ideal blend between teamwork and being competitive. Uh, it is beautiful, it's beautiful. But if you take the time to put in for the teamwork and then you ask questions, people like Chip uh, have helped me out tremendously w with everything. Same thing with Strapcorn. Um, they, they're always there to, to help out. So I love it, I love it, um, it's cool. Get to get to meet and make some uh, real good friends. Wow, we won in all sats. This is rare, guys. Uh, we rarely win in all sats. So good thing we did because this is going to be a bloodbath down here. Oh my gosh! All right, so yeah, this is this is just going to be a bloodbath. Come on, Denji, start spinning. There you go, buddy. There you go, Denji. All right, we're jumping in with uh, with the Rufio. We need to kill off some of this stuff. Hopefully we can get a decent amount of damage. Uh, we're in pretty deep on the dragon. Hopefully our Rufio can just legit take out their dragon. I would be very, very happy with that. Uh, they just stunned us up. Not cool. All right, so we are starting to burst through, which is good. Um, I can't see what that other thing is that's still up. Oh, oh, come on. Let me get the spray and pray. There we go. All right, we got the spray and pray coming out from Jax. That should be enough to uh, re really carry us through. Um, oh, no, they took down our, our Ophidius. That is not good. All right. Um, I, I didn't even look where I put that bat split. Make sure you guys look where you put your bat splits. Don't be like me. Um, anyways, we're, we're doing fine. We're, we're going to spin around, and uh, we're, we're going to do fine. They're, so their Ophidius, it looks like they took down our Avalon and our Ophidius. I mean, next fight, we're not going to have our dragon, so regardless, we're going to be pretty pretty gimped. Uh, we're, we're not going to be able to have like a super awesome next fight, but we just won three in a row. So that's really good for the team. Um, that That's just really, really good all around. Uh, so it looks like Omen left as well. So I, I think what, what we're going to do is we're going to hop out. That way we can reset all of our troops. And, uh, yeah, so, so sorry that we, we have a, a little bit of, of a wait. Uh, we're still doing great karma-wise, uh, which is huge. And, yeah, bottom we're winning, middle we're winning. Um, I don't know how we're winning middle. We're, we're not supposed to have too many people there. And then top, we are down by one. We just reset all of our troops. So hopefully, as, as long as they're, like, a 4,700K person, isn't like Im immediately there then uh, we should be fine to win some more fights for for the team um yeah it's cool stuff so uh toby toby ended up uh toby's story is kind of, kind of crazy so he ended up uh coming to blood moon from uh watching the videos uh, and he thought that it would be a cool house an active house uh one that wants to be competitive but he, he liked the philosophy of the house and uh he made a major sacrifice. He he uh it was not cheap for him to move and he moved and I'm so happy he did because uh he is a really, really good team player and he's just a fantastic guy all around. Um I tell him all the time and, and it is it, it is the truth. Uh I think I'm the biggest Toby fan out there. I just and sorry, sorry if that offends anybody. I just I I love everything to Toby does. He is just such a, a ridiculously good player um yeah of course uh like core size and everything matters but um ultimately it still takes a uh it still takes a um a, a, a good, good mind and a good player in order to uh achieve that all right so what, what do we have going on up here we got that person we got that person we got that person all right let, let's just move in we, we can take down some of these people <laughs> 
All right, we're going up against the Lich, so we just need to play safe going up against this Lich player. That way we don't lose our dragon. Um, but yeah, have, having Toby around, being able to ask Toby questions and uh, get, get some answers from him and see the innovation. So I remember back when Legend Rooney was doing this all the time and we, we'd have people in the house uh, start doing these things that seemed so like innovative and so ahead of their time. And... Um, yeah, so what what would happen is that they would be watching uh, Legend Rooney stuff and then duplicating that, and it, they'd stay like ahead of the curve for our server, for this specific server, and I think it was at, at like server twelve oh four or something like that. So uh, at at the time, it was, it was pretty new. Um, now it seems like an old server, but at the time it was new. And just like your server, at some point in time, if you're on like server three thousand three hundred and twenty one, at some point in time that's going to be considered an older server. So people do all of these uh, innovative things that they watch on, on YouTube. And it, it was just, uh, it was really, really cool. And um, anyways, fast forward to today where, where like I, I can actually be on that curve in like the Emerald Dragon that, that uh, to Toby started to use and, and be one of the first people to actually see that and then watch how it's impacted the game. Like, like how many people have the, Toby, uh, the Emerald Dragon now? And may, maybe they didn't get it from Toby. May, maybe they, they uh, connected the dots, which regardless, I mean, it's just cool. So um, anyways, it, it, it's really cool to have uh, had that, that viewpoint and, and be able to see uh, things in, in a different lens. All right, so it looks like that Rufio summed up our uh, Ophidius, which is super annoying. Uh, so we're actually going to jump in. Uh, we're going to try and get deep towards this top area, take out as many Warlocks as possible. Hopefully our Rufio doesn't just instantly collapse, although he's in there super deep. Our Yip is down. That's not cool. Um, we need our Jack Spray and Prey going. Uh, that way we can take out everything from, from this whole bottom section. Uh, and it looks like we're doing pretty good there. Our Rufio is uh, now down, uh, which, which is not good. But it's also not, not the end of the world. So we're going to do a little black hole because we just want to tie up as much of these warlocks as possible to keep our troops and everything alive. They have the targeting down on our dragon uh, currently, uh, which is not very nice if you ask me. Um, so that, that being said, we just need to kill off all of their stuff. They took down our fenders. We're actually going to be hurting after this fight, guys. Uh, no joke. Going up against Lich, they're just going to take down so much of your stuff. It, it's uh, it's annoying. Even if they're lower, Warlocks, guys, they are no joke all, all around. So we're, we're doing pretty good for, for right now. Uh, next fight, guys, we are going to be hurting. Um, and you know what? Uh, it's Clash of Fate. You, you, just, you gotta do what you gotta do. And if you're missing some stuff, uh, you still need to come out swinging and do your best. So we're going to... We're definitely going to be missing some stuff, but... Um, we still have to do what, what we came out to do. We, we have to win our fights and we got to help win it for the team. Plus we want that extra Lunari for, for the lucky wheel. I need that Ophidius skin. I, oh man, I don't know if you guys saw that video, but I, I can take the loss because I, I, I didn't go to 500. I didn't even go halfway. Um, I didn't go super heavy with it, but you still want to get that skin. You, every spin you're, you're like, oh, maybe this is the one. Um, all right, so it looks like we're doing fine there. I think we're going to go uh, hop uh, hop out, and uh, we can go... Let, let's go back to the, the bottom. Or should we go middle? We'll go... Uh, okay, I guess back to the bottom. Because they're, they're going to be mo moving around. So we're, we are missing out on a bunch of stuff right now. And are, are we doing okay there? Yeah, we're actually still doing we're still doing good. Um, so that forty seven hundred k person is back here. Um, is this the dwarf? Oh, yep. So we get the dwarf player here. Unfortunately, if I go up against this dwarf player, we might not win, guys. Uh, and the reason for that is um, we're missing too much stuff. But if the opportunity comes up, we're jumping on it because that is some juicy karma. I highly encourage all of you guys to, if you're going up against us, switch to Dwarf and only run mechs. Um, and only attack me. If you fight anybody else in the house, just put out one hero. Uh, I'd appreciate that. That was an awkward wink. Anyways, we're going to jump on to anybody here that we can, uh, except for the 4700k person. Uh, because 
that's not going to be good. Although the team might be looking at me like, hey, OGC, you should probably take this person out. They're going to attack me. Watch. Um, they, they're they're going to attack us in a second. Hopefully not. We got we got Chan here though. Chan Chan is like sleeper OP. Uh, Chan can take take people out. Um, like like no tomorrow. All right, we're gonna go back up against this Lich person. Uh, so with this Lich person, guys, uh, remember we are missing a bunch of stuff. They just moved a bunch of people in. So if I can pick off one or, one or two of these lower core people, um, that's gonna be huge for us because they just dumped a bunch of people in here. They're now they're now at eight people. They had four people in in here before. They're now down to seven. So somebody just got knocked out. Oh man, we're missing our our war horn. Wow, we're actually missing quite a bit, guys. So this is uh this is actually going to be pretty tough for us. Uh, but it doesn't matter. It does not matter, guys. You know why? We have to do the best that we can, no matter what. Um, so that's what we're going to do. It doesn't matter if we're down some stuff. I like that's all excuses. Um, we're still going to come out here and we're going to do the best that we can. And if we lose. That's not going to be good. <laughs> All right, let, let's just do it. Oh, geez, I hit the button too too soon. I like to sell them out. Okay, so this other person is selling it out because it's beneficial to them because they're winning in the Nexus to actually sell out this fight. Um, all right, hopefully, uh, now I'm nervous because we're, we're missing out on some key heroes. We have no Rufio, which means, <clears throat> excuse me, taking down their dragon. We're, we also don't have Yip, guys, and Yip has our Sage set. So we can't just instantly start off with anything crazy. Okay, this is the same Lich dude that just caused us all of those problems. So we don't have the uh, the, the Sage set to um, just instantly give us a, that giant boost. Which is not good, because we, we need that. Um, Alright, so we, we got that out there. I, it looks, looks like we, we just gotta go... Ooh, they're jumping in with their Rufio. Uh, if he takes out all of our archers, that's going to be bad. Looks like we're targeting their Rufio. Okay, their Rufio is down. We got the moral boost on our archers. That is massive, guys. I will gladly take that. Looks like our dragon's doing fine. Their warlocks in this middle area are starting to go down. There's, there's not a ton of them, which is which which is like really really nice for us. Um, we're also going to throw out a black hole just because we want to tie up as many of their warlocks as possible. Uh, their dragon is starting to go down. Their dragon is down. Now Now we can get our Denji and stuff into that back line, which, which for us is just massive. So we're going to get the Earthquake down. Earthquake's just going to slow down all of those Warlocks so much. And surprisingly, war, uh, uh, Earthquake actually does some decent damage. So we're going to put a Bat Split down just because why not. Um, our dragon is up. So we, we got enough for another fight in us. We got one one more good solid fight. Uh, we need to take down more of that stuff, and we're going to reload Jax that way he can just stay safe and blast everything down. Pretty good all, all around. I, I was expecting that they do more damage. I mean, we fought this guy the last match, and he, he actually caused us a lot of dam damage. So, uh, it's nice that this time he didn't do quite as much. Uh, granted, there's a lot less for him to actually kill. So, um, <laughs> it, you can't lose much if you don't have much. Um... So anyways, uh, good, good fight to this guy. And again, for for the, the people that um, we do beat with core power that still put out all their troops to fight, guys, that, that that's the type of player that I, I would want to play with because they're giving it all, their all. Even if it's uphill fight, they're still giving it the, their all. And they're also giving, giving that karma. Um, all right, let's go up against this self person. Right, you got to give that karma. I'd, we're, we do this for karma. Um, I am disappointed that we didn't get that dwarf player. Uh, that's okay. Hopefully we can get them again. If anybody else in our house gets them like back to back, they're, they're going to blow us out of the water when it comes to karma. But I figure for right now, we just want to be able to, uh, take out as many of this player's stuff as we possibly can. Um. I, I think I think that's just uh, beneficial towards us. Okay, so this is going to be tough because their power side guys is going to be down here. Um, this is going to be a rough match. I think that this guy's going to get us. 
And I just say that because their power side and our power side, they're going to match up because I think we fought this guy before. If that is the case, then um, this is it's just going to hurt uh, because we, we don't have a ton of stuff to actually combat them. So I think uh, I think we're going to do the same thing that we did last time, uh, or maybe we, we might try and get the uh, jacks going right right at the start. Maybe we'll wait and we'll, we'll do jacks. But we still got to get the Denji going. We'll see. We'll see. We'll play this one by ear. You know, you don't want to commit it to anything right right away. Uh, but I have a feeling, actually, we, we might have to. Oh, oh, it's just a Lunella. Okay, so, guys, this is also why you should put out everything every time. Because this guy, I really thought, would, would, would beat me it, if he did the power side. Because his Rufio would stun up all of our stuff in this bottom. And uh, our Huntresses would probably still carry us through. But, um... Yeah, I, I really think this guy could have, could have taken us. So that being said, uh, now we, we just have to wait. Are these people strong? So they get a 4,400k person in here, the 4,700k. So we're going to hop up because we don't have the dragon energy. Um, and we need the dragon energy. As sad as that sounds, we, we can't really do this w without it. All right, so uh, we're, we're up by 1,000 points right now. Uh, top we're tied, bottom we're tied. I, maybe I should have stayed in for the bottom. I, I don't know. In uh, middle, we're actually winning. So we're doing pretty good for right now. When we get out, uh, we'll see where we, we can go. Bottom side definitely has some really strong players for the enemy team. They had a 4,400k person there. They had a 4,700k person there. Uh, Blood Moon's probably like, OGC, oh, go take out those people. And o OGC is like, no, we, we, got, we got Chip Chan and Toby. They, they, they got this. Um... LOL Sun is actually now up uh, number one for Karma. Uh, we're, we're down to third. Uh, we have a little lead, but it's not not a big one. Toby's up there in, in fifth. Uh, Strapcorn's there in sixth. Chan's there in ninth. Uh, we, we, got the, uh, we got the team here, guys. All right, so it looks like we're winning in all three. Uh, when it comes to players, we have 20. They have 19, so it is pretty close. I'm, I'm glad we're finally getting back to having 20 people in Clash active for Blood Moon. It was really concerning not, not having the, the 20. Granted, one of the weeks I kind of slept through it because I, uh, I, I, I I was sick and did not feel good. But for right now, looks like we're doing pretty good. I'll take this. All right, so where should we go, guys? Let me know in the comment section below which Nexus you guys think I will enter. Um, oh, it's 8 to 5 there. 5 to 3, 5 to 3. Um, so for right now, it... I, I don't think we, we have a, uh, I don't think we necessarily have to go to a Nexus, so don't do what I'm doing right now, and, uh, don't, don't do this. <laughs> this is just mean and cruel and unusual. Um, but since we're winning in all three Nexus, I might as well go pick off the, these players. So, uh, they retreated. When people retreat in this, by the way, they go, they, they have to respawn. So that guy's going to go wait 90 more seconds in inside of, uh, he's going to go wait 90 seconds again. And he could have fought. All right, so how are we doing here? It's six, six to eight, so we're, we're doing fine. Oops, wrong thing. Uh, all right, we're, we're good all around. So if we can just pick off people, don't do this, guys, uh, for, for your house. Um. And I'm probably going to get yelled at when uh, Chip and Chan see this, but uh, don't don't do this. Although picking off that one guy, he he retreated, and that's considered a loss. So he's going to go sit sit for 90 more more seconds, which is horrible. So maybe we can um, if we can pick off another one one or two, I'll be I'll be happy. Right now we still have control of all three. It uh, doesn't look like we, we necessarily have to have anybody there. Um, Karma-wise, we, we would definitely get more points if we we're sitting in a city. Again, I don't care about Karma. If we can route people and they actually choose to, to get routed, uh, that, that's huge. Uh, he went too fast. Uh, he, he, he's just a little guy. All right, we'll, we'll move in anyways. Um, somebody else from here can take that person on. 
Oh, jeez. What what race are they, at least? Oh, they're Lich, too. Oh, God. How annoying is that? Not only are they super strong, but they're also Lich. That's like... Ugh. Ugh. I don't want to fight that. Alright, so the, the other guys here are going to be re relatively uh, easy uh, for, our, for our team. I should have gone middle. Um, you know, can't win it all. I'm going to jump in against this rocking guy, so I don't have to fight the 4700k person. And the end result is now he's going to attack somebody else. So I feel bad. Sorry, Blood Moon. Um, <laughs> I just don't want to go up against them. Um, I'm good with that. I'd much rather go up against the, uh, a, a rocking player. At least going up against this. Yeah, the guy might blow up some of my heroes, but I'm not going to lose, lose the dragon. All right, let's do this. All right, so Rockin going up against self. If they use monks and they have like good shocker monks, big issue for us. Big issue because uh, the monks will literally blow up the trees and everything, and especially the middle. So in a self formation, when you have the huntresses, either followed by heroes, which to counter that, like Chip told us yesterday, and he, he showed us it before, you just need to Earthquake and Spiderweb, and it's going to really disrupt the, the hero side. And then this top side, where you have the two trees with the banner of Valkyrie and, and Huntresses, those are going to be really hard for anybody to burst through. This middle section of uh, nine cells wide with three trees, if you can blast through that, and Ro Rock and Ken, uh, if you have monks and, and archers, you can literally blast th through that, and all of a sudden, you split the self formation into two little groups, and uh, that that's not good. Oh, so these people don't want us to win karma. Come on, give me the karma. Show me the Carfax. Um. Oh man. All right, black holes from the dragon took out Rose. Uh, jeez, I. Why don't they want us to have the karma? All right. Um. Oh, now we're down to seven. Strapcorn's up there. Ugh. If anybody's going to win karma, I don't want it to be Strapcorn. Strapcorn red. All right, so it looks like they're dropping people out. So now they're, they're going for karma, guys. They're going for karma. They, they've accepted that they have lost. There's 24 minutes left. Now they only have 14 players still in Clash of Fate. Uh, mostly because they, they want to make sure that their, their team... Uh, gets the, the best karma as possible. So, uh, man, that, that's su such a bummer. We're gonna run to this middle section because, uh, ooh, ooh. what? Okay, don't know what was going on there, but that's just weird. Oh man, what a bummer. All right, so we just picked off another person as they're running down for the Nexus. Oh, my God. If you read the, the chat, Super Bob's talking about how, how uh, noobs are picking off people from outside. <laughs> That's me. Sorry, Super Bob. I'm that guy. <clears throat> so maybe this guy. Oh, okay. I didn't know if they were going to retreat or not. So they are not retreating, uh, which is fine. We're just going to go in. Um, we're going to try and speed up these fights because, uh, why not? Oh my god. So, if you guys ever do get dueled on the outside, uh, you might as well do the fight. Because if you lose, or if you decide to, um, like, like uh, decline the fight and hit, like, run or whatever it is. I, I forget the button, uh, or what it's called. You're, you're automatically, it's considered a loss, and you're going to spend 90 seconds in the respawn anyways. So you might as well accept the fight, even if you're going to lose. Because um, you're going to tie up the, the other person for as long as possible. So, anyways, uh, we're going to go up against this person. I'm going to bet it's going to be a lone uh, Rufio. Let me know in the comment section what, what single hero you think I'm going to go up against in this fight. Oh, it's a lone Bazrix. Oh my gosh. All right. So we're going up against Bazrix. Uh, hopefully we win. Um, if we lose, this is going to be really bad. Uh, probably career ending bad. Um, which is, uh, you know, it's sad. We're going to do Denji. Get Denji spinning. Uh, that way he lags way behind. Look at how cool that Denji skin is. So I, I don't have the Ophidia skin. 
But we do have the Denji skin, so I, I really can't be upset about that. Alright, so what's going on here? Uh, their badge race was, was in his little cocoon, healing up. Uh, which everybody else stopped and watched him because they're like, wow, that's so cool. Alright, so middle, there, there's like that one player there. Bottom still is back up to three. They're up to 15 people. Yeah, oh, yeah, look, look at this. Where is it? All right, let's let's say uh, my my whoops, my bad, Bob. <laughs> oh my God! All right, let's hop in here. Uh, we got one more dragon energy, so that's like one one more fight that that we can actually do. Um, oh, lol, son says hi, YouTube. Oh man, that's that's pretty funny with uh, Super Bob. All right, we're gonna go up against this player because we have the fastest fingers, and that allows us to actually get into the fight. Um, awesome, awesome. So let me know in the comment section below what single hero you think we're going to go up against this time. I think they're really trying to protect honor, uh, not honor, uh, karma for their team. So that's why I'm assuming that they're gonna put out one hero because uh, we I think we're still in the top ten or somewhere around there. That being said, uh, just l l let me know what, what, what do you think. Um, anyways, let's go see if... Uh, oh, the curry said, said hi. Um, hi, the curry. It depends on the day. Sometimes he's like a green curry. Some days he's like a yellow curry. Some days, if he's upset, he's a red curry. It, it's pretty good, pretty good all, all around. Hopefully they don't watch this video and notice that I'm attacking people on the outside of the Nexus because that would be super awkward. There's one thing I'm good at, it's being awkward. So I mean, maybe that is, maybe they, I, hopefully they watch this, you know? Uh, if we're gonna get awkward, we might as well get awkward together. That sounds awkward. I'm going to guess we're going to go up against a lone Vega. Yep, we're going up against Lich. I think it's... Oh, oh, whoa! So if you guess one hero in the comment section below, you're wrong. As am I. Um, wow. I did not see this coming. So, uh, as always, we're going to start off with the Denji spin, because uh, why not? As Hilary Duff uh, once said. Uh, their whole backline just got destroyed by Black Holes and Gafkar. I'm sorry, but even with 95% damage mitigation or whatever is that, you're no match for an entire army. All right, so they got a dude there. They got a dude there. Oh, we don't have dragon energy, so that's that's actually going to be an issue for us. Um, that, that that's going to be a, a major issue. Um, so how how do I see my my, my troops now? I just want to know, know my, my dragon. Uh, so, yeah, we, we've had three fights. We've deployed the dragon three times. Uh, so I think what, what we're going to do is... Should we do that? Uh, yeah, now we're at 10th in Karma. Ugh. Nope. Don't want that guy. All right, we'll take this guy. Uh, we're going after this guy because um, we don't have a dragon. I bet you they're going to field everything. So when it comes to our guessing game, I uh, I don't know if they're going to place everything. And I guess it's not really fair to say that, you know, they're either going to place everything or they're going to place one hero. You know, like, eh, it's, it's like, which is it, OGC? Um, that makes my, my guessing really hard. Oh, oh, no, I just lost a bunch of heroes. Um... Yeah, that, that makes my, my guessing like really hard. All right, I'm gonna go with uh, Slitch, a lone gazool. That's my guess. Let me know in the comment section what you guys think. Are they gonna do their whole army? I, I Actually, I take back the gazool thing. I think this guy's gonna field an army. I think uh, this guy's gonna field an army and if I'm a betting person, we're going to lose because we don't have a dragon. I'm just saying, just saying. Don't don't hate the player, OGC. Hate the game. I'm just kidding. This is a great game. Don't don't hate it. 
All right, so we got uh, five seconds. We're going to find out. I'm guessing whole army, if it is a single hero, is Kazul. Oh, it's a Bazrix. We did this guy before, didn't we? Oh, my God. All right, so it's the lone Bazrix guy. Yes, we did do this one before. If you guys guess Bazrix down in the comment section, just reach around and give yourself a pat on the back because you, you got this correct. And I'm proud of you for that. So, uh, Blood Moon is going to be able to pick up their second win in Clash of Fate uh, for this season, uh, which means that we'll go up to two out of four wins. Um, not the best season in the whole wide world. Uh, oh, they're down to nine players now. It's not the uh, greatest season in the whole wide world, but it's also not the worst. That being said, I think we're going to cut this one short because they're pulling players out. It's not even going to be a close match. Tomorrow, guys, we'll have some PvP replays uh, from the other players. We can see, like, LOL Sun and others. Um, and with that, uh, yeah, please take a moment to uh, like, share, subscribe, as always. That helps out the channel so much. I highly recommend go back watch uh, yesterday's live stream. It's now in, like, a video format if you want to hear from... Uh, Toby, uh, Chip, and Taint, uh, some amazing players. If a AHS was still around, I'd love to have him on. We're also going to have, uh, I think we're going to do this uh, more often, uh, although I don't think I'm going to live stream ne next weekend. I, I have too much to do. Um, I think we're going to do this more often, and I'm going to try and include other people as well. That way we can kind of have have one of the, like, the big three or a couple of the big three in and rotate other people in just, just to get more perspectives because... At the end of the day, this is a community-based game, and we want to include the community as much as possible. So with that, guys, uh, yeah, uh, we have some cool stuff in the description below. You can go to the OGC merch store and get some really cool merch. Like, I, I got that awesome phone case. I love it. Uh, it works. It, it really won't protect your phone at all. But, um, oh, uh, it, it really won't protect your phone if you drop it. It's not like an otter box, but it will look cool. And if you are single, it will guarantee that you won't be single. Also, we have the OGC Community Discord. Go check that out. That's where I first met Chip. That's how I ended up in Blood Moon. Uh, so you can network there and create friendships that could last an entire lifetime or until you log off. Uh, and finally, we have uh, Patreon. So if you guys do want to further support this channel, uh, go check out Patreon. I, there's nothing that I can really offer uh, that, that's like super unique or cool. Um, and unfortunately, I, I, with, with my new job and everything, I, I don't have the... Uh, time to necessarily sit down and go over everybody's accounts and anymore, but um, there is some cool stuff there. So uh, go go check it out. Um, only if you want to support the, this channel further, uh, I do appreciate all of it, and all of our patreons are just amazing. We're about to lose to this human player because uh, we don't have a dragon, um, and they do, and dragons are like a big deal or something now. I guess I I don't know. Uh, so. After this fight, uh, we will end it. Um, we jumped in with the Rufio. I, I really don't know why. I didn't really think that one through. We're, we're probably going to lose this one. Uh, and and that, that's okay. You know, you, you can't win them all. Um, yeah, it's actually really, really, uh, really challenging with, without a uh, without a dragon. Uh, it adds on like a new level of, of the game. Um, and you're, you're just kind of like, oh my god. I forgot how easy the game was when, when, when we had a dragon. Um... And we're also missing different heroes, too. Anyways, that's just a bunch of excuses. Uh, now we are going to blow them up up there. We're going to summon some archers, because why not? Um, looks like they have a Rufio nice and deep on, on, to, on top of our jacks and stuff. Our Ophidius is down. We're going to lose this one, guys, because we had no dragon. Uh, let's see here. We're going to do that, and we're going to spend, s s spin that guy around. So anyways, guys, as always, uh, please make sure to like, share, subscribe, and I'm going to go finish losing this fight because uh, that's what we do here. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Take care, guys.